I was born on the 1st of April 1992 in the small town of Arkhangelsk, which is right at the top of Russia. I was placed into an orphanage as soon as I was born and I was adopted at the age of two by my New Zealand parents. They also adopted my brother Andre at the same time. Yes, I've always known I was adopted from Russia. My parents always said, you know, both of you boys are both adopted from a small town, a small orphanage in Russia. And to us, that was very important to know. During my childhood years, I was always interested about my birth parents. My mum and dad were always open and honest about me being adopted. It was always something that they were completely open about. And when I was 21, I decided I wanted to start the search and track them down. I wanted to make that contact with them and I really wanted to know exactly who they were. So I started looking at information that was given to me from the orphanage and I started looking up names like my birth mother and then looking up the names on the piece of paper that had my birth father's name on there. I looked through community groups, Russian social media websites, things like that and I eventually tracked down my birth mother. When I tracked down my birth mother and I started talking to my birth mother on the phone, I then talked to my birth father on Skype and that pushed me. I really wanted to go and meet them now and that was the next big step. So I pushed myself to do that. I was I was saying, look, I need to go and meet these people. I want to go and find out about their lives. I want to find out who they are. I want to learn about their lives. And that's what I did. So I flew from New Zealand to Moscow. And the next day, we drove to meet my birth mother. It was, it was pretty incredible for myself. Hello. Здорово, здорово. Благодарю. Привет. Hello. With the language barrier in the beginning, it was hard. It was really hard. I wanted to ask so many questions. I just wanted to sit down and talk to both my birth parents all day and ask as many questions, but I really couldn't do that. I just said, thank you. Thank you for letting me meet you, letting me into your life again, and just let's focus on the now and the future and forget about the past. Ah, the, oh, okay. Hello. Grandmother. Hello. I was, I felt complete when I met my birth mother and of course <laughs> meeting my birth father felt very complete. He was, he changed my life. Благодарен, что ты есть, что ты все-таки нашел меня, что ты сам вот это все вот сделал. Я просто, еще раз повторюсь, я просто не знал о твоем существовании вообще. Поэтому большое тебе спасибо. Ну, его вкратце там что-нибудь скажи ему. My mum and dad in New Zealand who adopted me were completely supportive of me tracking down my birth family. I was very, very thankful for that. Very grateful for my parents helping me with the journey, helping me with the search and just everything like that. They wanted me to find my birth parents. I've been to Russia eight times now, so I keep in touch with both of them. I send letters to my birth mother and I keep in touch with my birth father on the phone, social media, all of that, so it's great. <laughs>